with our breaking news. Ian, the Bears are not getting Russell Wilson. They are getting... Andy Dalton. Andy Dalton reunites with Bill Lazor, who of course... No, God! No, God, please, no! So, you know, as a Bears fan, I was really excited because I've seen, you know, articles like these talking about we most likely going to get either Deshaun Watson or Russell Wilson because they prepared to offer them, like, a big deal, a big package of picks, you know, and players. And I was really optimistic that we were going to get him, right? One, I'm optimistic we were going to get one of them guys. And, you know, now today the news broke that, you know, we got a different player. And, you know, I was optimistic, you know, I'm wondering, okay, who who is it? You know, is he good? And I was hoping for the best. But, you know, after, you know, seeing seeing the evidence in front of my eyes of who we got, it's 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 hard you know, to, 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 you know, be a Bears fan right now, and I like to, you know, voice my frustrations, you know, through this video, and hopefully, Ryan Pace sees this video, and he apologizes for making my life so, you know, upsetting when it comes to football. Now, this, this man right here, if you don't know, is Ryan Pace, the GM of our of the Chicago Bears and I sometimes question his IQ level and how he possibly got the job as a GM in the NFL you know um at first I was optimistic in this offseason maybe he can turn around you know all the bad things he's done for our team with our signings or our draft picks maybe he can get Russell Wilson or Deshaun Watson I would forgive him for everything however he has lied he has let us bamboozled, led us astray, and he has done nothing to make my life more uh, desirable when it comes to football. So let's just see what he was talking about and blowing smoke up everybody's ears a couple weeks ago in this interview clip I'm going to show right now. Hi, Ryan. Uh, do you have a plan you feel is going to get you a starting quarterback? Starting quarterback. Starting quarterback. Yeah. Uh, hey, Brad. Really, right now for us, everything's on the table in regard to the quarterback situation. And and honestly, that includes players on our current roster. That includes free agency, uh, trade, uh, the draft, and, and a combination of all those. So, uh, we have a we have a plan in place. We have a plan in place. We have a plan in place. And now it's about uh, executing that plan. So as you guys have just heard with your own ears, he said we will be getting a starting quarterback, and we have a plan that we need to execute on. You know, after hearing that, I'm I'm thinking you know he's going to actually do what he said. But you know, let's just uh let's just roll the next clip and uh you know see what his plan ended up being. So. Without further ado, this is what we ended up with. So, this is the guy who we have signed to be our starting quarter. Oh, I'm sorry. This must be an earlier picture of him. Let me change that. Okay, so, yeah, this is the correct picture. This is the guy who we have signed to lead our team. And, you know, I'm not going to lie. I don't think he's capable of being a starting quarterback. And I'm just going to say that straight up. Like, I have no problem with Andy Dalton. You know, he, he has, he's had, he's been a good player in the past. But the fact of the matter is, we were going to get Deshaun Watson or Russell Wilson. Supposedly, there are interest, there are high uh, rumors saying that that was going to happen. And um, now we now we ended up with him. And it's just like, we might as well have just re-signed Trubisky, if you ask me. Because I, I don't like Trubisky as a player, but I take him over Andy Dalton. And it's just like... What what are we what are we doing, guys? Like Ryan Pace, what are you, what is, what are you trying to do with our team? Like, and you know what? Um, I'm just gonna stop talking about this. But you know, this is just some something I wanted to do to just express my frustrations with Ryan Pace. And you know, hopefully Andy Dalton ends up being really good, and you know we make the playoffs. But I wouldn't get my hopes up.